So often I get asked the question, what can physical therapy or physical therapists provide in the way of treating someone who might have uh, a disc-related problem uh, stemming from the temporal mandibular joint, specifically a closed lock or what we would call uh, a non-reducing disc displacement. And uh, again, uh, when it comes to physical therapy, it's very helpful to find, uh, in particular, someone who might have the credentials of CCTT or CFC, craniofacial certification. Uh, it does require extra training and specialty in the field of physical therapy to treat these problems. But for example, we have the ability with our hands to do uh, very conservative uh, manual treatments, uh, particularly working on the muscles and the soft tissue structures around the joint, but also very specific and focused and gentle mobilization techniques to the temporal mandibular joint itself to eventually take a jaw that is not opening well and slowly and progressively op over time improving that opening and that ability. And then of course once we've achieved a good functional outcome, uh, then we will proceed with various exercises, range of motion, different modalities, heat or cold, to help uh, with any discomfort that might come along the way to restore function. Uh, so it can be very rewarding, very conservative, uh, uh, with a very excellent outcome with this approach. Uh, my name is Mike Karaginas, uh, Freedom Physical Therapy. I'm here attending once again an amazing uh, conference uh, with the American Academy of Oral Facial Pain 2016 here at Disney. Uh, I'm also a, a board member with the uh, Physical Therapy Board of Craniocervical Therapeutics. Uh, so very excited to be here and be a part of this event.